What's up, everyone? Welcome to the Nerd Round. I'm Kyle the Wanderer, and on today's Card Vault series, I'm going to show you the Pokemon card from Base Set Unlimited. Number 10, Mewtwo. So, without further ado, let's reveal the card. So there it is, the Pokemon card Mewtwo from Base Set Unlimited. Now, you can see in the top left corner of the card that this is a basic stage Pokemon card. Pokemon cards are the main cards used in the game to battle your opponents. Basic Pokemon cards can be put into play directly without any requirements. Below the stage title, you have the title of the card, which in this case is Mewtwo. In the top right corner of the card, you have the Pokemon's HP or hit points, which in this case is 60. Next to that, you have the symbol of the Pokemon's energy type, which in this case is Psychic. Below that, you have the card illustration. We'll take a closer look at that in a moment. Below the illustration, you have some Pokedex data. Mewtwo is a genetic Pokemon. Its average length is 6 feet 7 inches. Its average weight is 269 pounds. Below the data, you have the Pokemon's attack moves or abilities. Mewtwo's first move is Psychic, which states, does 10 damage plus 10 more damage for each energy card attached to the defending Pokemon. The attack does 10 plus damage, and the requirement to use the attack is one psychic and one colorless energy. Mewtwo's second move is Barrier, which states, Discard one psychic energy card attached to Mewtwo in order to use this attack. During your opponent's next turn, prevent all effects of attacks, including damage done to Mewtwo. The requirement to use the attack is 2 Psychic Energy. Underneath the moves, on the left side, you have the Pokemon's weakness, which in this case is Psychic. In the center, you have the Pokemon's resistance, which in this case, Mewtwo doesn't have a resistance. On the right side, you have the Pokemon's retreat cost, which in this case is 3 Energy. Below this, you have the Pokemon's Pokédex entry, which reads as follows. A scientist created this Pokemon after years of horrific gene splicing and DNA engineering experiments. After that, you have the featured Pokemon's current level, which in this case is level 53. Next to that, you have the Pokemon's Pokédex number, which in this case is Pokédex number 150. Down in the right corner is the card set number, which is number 10 out of 102. Next to that, you have the card rarity symbol. The star represents a rare card, and since the background of the card artwork has a holographic foil, this card is considered a hollow rare card. To the left of the set number, you have the copyright information, which is owned by Nintendo, Creatures, and Game Freak and the card is made by Wizards. To the left of the copyright, you have the Illustration Artist. This card was illustrated by Ken Sugimori. Speaking of the illustration, let's take a closer look at it now. The illustration features drawn artwork of a bipedal, purple and white, humanoid-like creature. The Mewtwo has an oval-shaped white head with a small, rounded snout with small black slits for nostrils. Extending from Mewtwo's snout is a short, closed mouth. Above Mewtwo's mouth is a furrowed brow with slanted, triangular-shaped white eyes with purple pupils. Extending from the sides and top of Mewtwo's head are two white, fin-like protrusions in place of ears. Attached behind Mewtwo's head is a white tube-like body feature that curves down and attaches to Mewtwo's upper back. Below Mewtwo's head is a slender neck. 
The Mewtwo's white body is slender and curved, where the upper part of its body, encompassing its pecs and shoulders, is sectioned off and elevated, similar to football pads. The lower portion of Mewtwo's body has a rounded purple area that curves between its legs, extending as one with its long and large purple tail with a rounded tip where the tail extends upwards behind the Mewtwo and then in the middle curves back down towards its feet. Attached to Mewtwo's shoulders are two long and slender white arms with hands that consist of three circular fingers. In the illustration, Mewtwo's arms are slightly lifted to its midsection and spread apart in an open arms type of stance. Attached at the lower end of Mewtwo's body, on the outside of the purple section, are two thick white legs. The upper thighs of the legs are wide and rounded and extend down to slender ankles with long white feet. Each foot has two large rounded toes with a circular toe on the inside of the foot near the heel. Surrounding the Mewtwo is a thin red aura. The Mewtwo is standing on a purple holographic background with curved darker purple rays that start off thin at the top and become wider around the bottom extending out from behind the Mewtwo in a spiral-like manner. The background has the resemblance to cracked glass, or in this case, Mewtwo is cracking the background. And there you go. That about wraps up our up close look at the Pokemon card Mewtwo from Base Set Unlimited. Stay tuned for the next card in this Card Vault series presented by the Nerd Realm. So, what are your thoughts on this card? And did you ever own a copy of this card? Let me know in the comments down below. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. And if you'd like to see more, please hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so you can be notified when new videos are live. These simple actions will help to greatly support this channel. If you'd like to help support this channel to grow even more, visit my Patreon page at patreon.com slash thenerdrealm where you can receive exclusive benefits such as early access to videos and more. And if you'd like to get your hands on your own Pokemon cards, visit my web store, trainermerch.com, where we have thousands of Pokemon card singles and codes, and every purchase helps to directly support this channel. Check out these next videos on the screen. Thanks for watching, and as always, keep it nerdy.